The Council of Ministers convened in a weekly session at Bayan Palace today under the chairmanship of His Highness Sheikh Jabal Limbarak al Hamad al Subah, the Prime Minister. The Council welcomed at the outset of his session the return home of His Highness the Emir after a private visit to the United States and United Kingdom, during which he underwent a successful simple surgery. The Minister of State for Cabinet Affairs, Sheikh Mohammed Abdullah Limbarak al Subah, said the Council of Ministers expressed happiness at His Highness the Emir's full recovery and wished him a long life and best of health. He added that the cabinet welcomed the guests of His Highness the Emir, chief delegates of the Arab countries who will take part on the 25th of summit of the Arab League, which will be hosted by the State of Kuwait on the 25th and 26th of March. The Minister of State for Cabinet Affairs said the cabinet expressed hope that this gathering would lead to positive results at this critical junction of the Arab nation's history. The Council of Ministers also welcomes the visit to Kuwait tomorrow, Tuesday, by His Excellency Mr. Mahdi Juma, Prime Minister of the Republic of Tunisia. The Council of Ministers was also notified of the two messages to His Highness the Emir from His Highness Sheikh Tamim bin Hamad Al Thani, Emir of the State of Qatar, and His Excellency President Michel Sleiman of Lebanon. The two leaders accepted the invitations to take part in the Arab summit later this month. The Council of Ministers also took note of the message to His Highness the Emir from His Excellency Ban Ki moon, the UN Secretary General, who invited His Highness to attend the climate summit due to convene at the United Nations headquarters on the 23rd of September 2014. The Council of Ministers then was informed of the message to His Highness the Prime Minister from His Excellency Evo Morales, President of Bolivia, inviting His Highness to attend the summit of the 7th of 77, which will convene on Bolivia during next June. The Minister of State for Cabinet Affairs said that the Deputy Premier and Minister of Interior briefed the Council on the outcome of the 31st session of the Council of Arab Interior Ministers, which convened in the Kingdom of Morocco recently. And finally, the Council of Ministers discussed the political affairs in light of the incoming reports related to the latest Arab and international developments.